Australia is a land girt by seas that sustain our way of life. But as our climate changes, how can we protect the oceans Australia relies on? Our coastal ecosystems exist in delicate balance. The slightest change, a degree's rise. The top scientific body on the planet is recommending the Great Barrier Reef be listed as in danger. A diseases outbreak. Prawn farmers devastated by white spot disease. A habitat's harm. An urgent health warning tonight on a dangerous toxic outbreak can be catastrophic. Sustainability is an exact science. And space technology is letting us look after our oceans with more accuracy than ever before. In the Spencer Gulf, kingfish farmers know toxic algae can thrive in warmer waters and decimate the year's catch. In situ sensors floating among the farms can detect the presence, volume and movement of blooms and recommend the most sheltered positions for farmers' pens. After a devastating outbreak in 2017, white spot disease still pervades the Moreton Bay prawn population. But space technology is helping local farmers adapt and rebuild. Satellites can combine current, wind speed and disease data, visualising living maps that make it easier to contain the spread and guide sustainable fishing. Globally, coral bleaching could claim up to 90% of reefs by 2050, threatening Australia's heritage-listed Great Barrier Reef. A global coral atlas is using hyperspectral imaging satellites to scan oceans for bleaching in real time, sharing critical data with scientists, policymakers and conservationists around the world to inform positive future change. From above the stars to below the waves, space technology is unlocking a deeper understanding of our underwater worlds. When oceans are under threat, space has the answers.